Whether you're creating a short clip for social media or a full feature film, picking the right tool can make the difference between the success or failure of your video project. But with so many options available, how do you choose the best one for your needs? Today we're going to take a look at the five best video editing software. Let's start. At number five, Pinnacle Studio 23, best for beginners. Pinnacle Studio Plus offers a wide array of organising, editing and exporting tools that make it attractive video editing software. Its unique and intuitive workflow allows import, sort and build projects from your media clips. It contains all the tools you need to transform your raw footage into a finely polished video you'll be happy to share. I would say that this is one of the best video editing softwares for beginners because it's pretty easy to use. It has a lot of features which can be found on high-end professional video editing software, but they are much easier to use when compared to those high-end video editing applications. It provides 24 video and audio editing tracks to work with. This is enough to meet the needs of most video producers. One of the most useful features found in Pinnacle Studio is the video template creator. When you're done with a video, you can save it as an outline for future projects by selecting which cuts you want to be placeholders. When you want to make a new video with that template, all you have to do is drag and drop your new footage in. This is fantastic if you make lots of similar videos regularly, and it can save you hours of time in the long run. It also has a lot of pre-programmed objects, including thousands of effects, titles, transitions and templates to work with. These tools give editors the flexibility and versatility they need to create complex projects. If you simply want to make a video file for your computer, this video editor lets you export in all the most popular video formats like MP4, MOV and AVI. You can also upload your video to your YouTube, Facebook or Vimeo accounts without leaving the program, which is a big time saver over uploading files manually. The downside of Pinnacle Studio 23 is that if you want to be able to edit 4K or 360 degree videos, you'll need to upgrade to the ultimate version of this software. Otherwise, it's a great option for almost all beginners that are trying to get into video editing. At number 4, Filmora 9, easiest to use. Filmora started as a very simple video editing software which was used to create slideshows and similar things. However, it has come a long way and it's become one of the best video editing softwares out there. In fact, even we use Filmora to edit some of our videos. Anyone who's used a video editor will find Filmora 9's interface to be very familiar. It has a very similar layout to many of its rivals, but has an indefinably more polished feel than others. On-screen text, titles and on-screen elements, such as graphic overlays, are handled with equal aplomb, and it's hard to find fault with what's on offer. If you have some extra money to spend, they have a library which lets you use hundreds of different titles, transitions and effects. Even if you don't have any extra money to spend, the hundreds of included effects should already satisfy all your needs. Filmora 9 makes creating titles as simple as possible. You can choose from about 140 pre-programmed templates, including opening and closing credits, titles, lower thirds and subtitles. They're excellent for creating a cinematic, journalistic and fun look for your video. Filmora's timeline can handle up to 100 layers, which means that if you want to create some complex videos, Filmora can handle it. Simple videos probably won't require more than two or three, but if you're editing a feature film, music video or other complicated product, it's great to have the flexibility. Basically, I'd say that if you're looking for a video editing software that's great at editing videos for YouTube, then you can't go wrong with Filmora. Even though it isn't suitable for editing high-end footage such as RED, you can edit 1080p and 4K footage effortlessly, which should be more than enough. At number 3, Vegas Pro 17 best for intermediates. Vegas Pro, one of the oldest video editing softwares out there, is still relevant to this day. What I love about them is that they update their software almost every year and they include new features and they keep up with the new trends. Even though it isn't as easy to use as Filmora or Pinnacle Studio, you can get the hang of it pretty easily. Vegas Pro handles all manner of source materials including a wide variety of video formats, still photos in a wide variety of formats, etc. It handles them all in a consistent manner and outputs everything in a consistent manner. Other video editing programs we've used in the past often have problems with mixing different sources, but Vegas Pro does it effortlessly. Vegas Pro comes with many transition effects, video filters, audio effects, audio filters, etc. Almost everything you need to do professional quality video and audio is built in. With a few low-cost add-ons, you can do even more. You can use Vegas Pro exclusively for all of your audio and video editing, production and mastering needs. It's really the perfect solution for everything you need to do in this multimedia world. 
Vegas Pro has three major advantages over Adobe Premiere. Cost, built-in effects, and learning curve. If you haven't used any high-end video editing software before, like Premiere Pro or After Effects, I think you'll find yourself making high-quality videos faster with Vegas than you would with Adobe Premiere Pro. Both programs come with everything you need to make high-quality videos, but Premiere Pro offers a bit more than everything you need. Between the two programs, Vegas Pro is a bit more intuitive and easy to learn, and that's why I listed it at number three on this list as the best video editing software for intermediate video editors. Overall, I'd say that it's a great tool that can fulfill all your video editing needs without having to spend a lot of time learning about the editing process. Number two, DaVinci Resolve 16, best free option. DaVinci Resolve is one of the best, if not the best, free video editing software out there. It has a paid version, which has some advanced features, but unless you're editing cinematic movies and stuff like that, I don't think you'll be needing them. The paid version offers more effects and templates, and among others the ability to edit in 4K and up to 120fps, in addition to more under-the-hood performance improvements. It has a ton of features, but also it's extremely hard to navigate through the software. At times, its user interface resembles a science laboratory, with all sorts of buttons and graphs on display. Though it looks complicated, it is slick and well-designed, with a professional feel to it. It might take a lot of sleepless nights to learn to use it, but in the end, it'll be worth it. The interface itself is divided into six sections. Media, where you import and manage the clips you need. Edit, where you build your project. Fusion, a powerful 2D and 3D video effects compositor. Color, impressive color grading tools. Fairlight, highly precise audio manipulation. And finally, Deliver, where you export your project ready to share it with the world. DaVinci Resolve can handle 4K and it also supports 8K editing, so if you've got a beefy PC that can handle some heavy-duty work, you can create movies in ultra-high definition. I have nothing but good words for DaVinci Resolve, but if you're someone that just wants to create videos for YouTube or make some short movies, then this program is not for you because it's very complicated and learning to use it properly will take a lot of time. However, if you're serious about video editing and you want to get a career in that field, then DaVinci Resolve is one of the best software for that. At number one, Adobe Premiere Pro. Best overall. Premiere Pro is one of the best video editing softwares for professionals and amateurs. It's a great choice for people who have basic knowledge of film creation and want to produce video content at a professional level. The reasons for its popularity are quite clear. Thanks to its familiar non-linear editing interface, unmatched ecosystems of tools and powerful set of capabilities. This software is used by Hollywood employees and allows users to turn unprocessed shots into fully-fledged cinematographic products. You have access to tools that help you do more than just video editing. This is definitely one of the best movie editing softwares that gives you an opportunity to adjust colour, sound and more. It has a selection of effects you can apply to your movies, there are tons to choose from, and they're easy to apply. Once you find one, you'll get a selection of options to refine how the effect behaves and get things looking exactly right. There are far too many to list here, but they include stylistic effects, distortions, blurs, adjustments, colour effects, and more. There's also a large number of transitions too, enabling you to make your cuts more interesting. The interface looks clean and minimalistic for the professional video editing software. That's because in Premiere Pro, a lot of functions are hidden behind keyboard shortcuts as most of the professionals use them. However, you can add any hidden buttons to the panels and move them around the way you want. Just place a cursor and drag the panel around. Premiere Pro is basically the most advanced video editing software out there. It's not easy to use, but once you get used to it, you will feel invincible. Almost all movies you see are created with Premiere Pro, and that alone should say enough. If you want to get serious about video editing, definitely get the Premiere Pro and you won't go back. Thank you for watching. I hope this video will help you decide between the best video editing software out there. Most of the software we listed here are pretty similar and can get the job done pretty well. But when it comes to professional use, you need to look for some high-end software such as the Premiere Pro and DaVinci Resolve.